Hey, what's up everybody? This is Out of Focus here again. Today's a very good day. I'm gonna be taking my first ride on my Ritmo V2S. Um, I spent about two years on a Ritmo V1 and I love that damn bike. That bike was like a Swiss Army knife. Um, you could do anything on that bike. You could climb, you could go on long rides, you could descend on the thing, you could, you could jump it around. That bike was perfect. Um, but I had to move on to a new bike, so I uh, wasn't too familiar with the uh, V2 specs or the V2S specs. Um, the only thing different I know about this thing is they use a universal derailleur hanger, um, which is pretty convenient, and they wind up the rear end of the bike to stiffen it up a little bit. So I guess people that like to whip and land sideways, that might be pretty beneficial for them. So overall, man, I'm really liking the new logo and uh, the colorways they have, or the color scheme they have on the thing. It's pretty sick looking, and I'm looking, looking forward to riding the thing and letting you guys know how it performs out there. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with the Ritmo V2S. It still maintains that playful feel out there on those mellow trails. The newly added chainstay protection adds an awesome rugged look to the bike. The V2S is still an excellent climber for a longer travel bike. Maybe not as well as other bikes, but perfect for a long steady grind up to elevation. The V2S really comes to life on the downs. With the slacker head angle from the Ritmo V1, it was the first thing I noticed. It feels like the bike wants to eat up whatever is thrown in its way while still maintaining that nimble feel. All right, everybody, the verdict's in for the Ritmo V2S. Definitely the first thing that comes to mind, a word to describe this bike, it's definitely a brawler. Compared to the V1, this bike likes to crush the downhills. Um, it's still a playful bike, um, but it's more of a serious brawler. Um, the only con I can actually think of with this bike would be the uh, water bottle cage here. You can see at the base of the water bottle, it contacts the frame. Um, I had this problem with my Ritmo V1 also. Over a longer period of time, that water bottle will actually start to groove the frame. Um, I haven't really looked around or researched any solutions for that, but um, hopefully some company makes a different type of water bottle cage. I'm not very familiar with that, but if you guys are, please let me know in the uh, comments down below this video. So that's all guys. Thanks for watching.